Lieutenant Chad Parker, Concord Fire Department, North Carolina. We got a department of roughly 230 firefighters, 11 stations, and we cover a population of about 100,000 people. We're here today to talk about our two Pierce Enforcers 2019 we recently purchased uh, and some different specs. We went with the Pierce Enforcer chassis. It gave us uh, good visibility for the firefighters, drivers, uh, good room in the cab for the personnel. We paired it with an LS9 Cummins, which 450 horsepower, which provides us good durability and overall performance is what, what we're looking for. Uh, we went with a unique backlit door handles to give the, 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 give the truck a little unique look when it's in park, when we're showing the truck off a little bit, have a little pride. We, uh, inside of the truck's pretty simple. We got some unique features. We, our Knox box, our dual key Knox box under the seat, easy for the officer to get when we're running calls. We also have a dual vision front and rear safety camera, which is to protect liability to firefighters and the, and the citizens if there is an accident. MDT mount, different options for air horn mechanical siren for the officer to help out the driver. Entering the rear of the cab, we have uh, two forward facing seats, one rear facing, a compartment we'll keep all our EMS bags, stuff for uh, medical events. We got storage under the seats, and we also have tool boards to mount stuff beside the seats. And the things we mount will be securely fastened so they can't be thrown around. Another unique feature, we want a diamond plate floor, which is easy to clean. You can wash out with a hose if you need to, and don't have to worry about you know, ripping or messing it up. We got a, a New York hook here on the back of the cab, easy access for a firefighter. The unique Pierce gives us this unique option, to, convenient for firefighters as they get off the truck. A two inch and three quarter cross lays, 200 foot, a water can storage, and also in this compartment we have another extinguisher storage makes it easy access for a firefighter when they get off the truck, they have what they need right here. We uh, keep our two and a half inch high rise packs in this tray, secured with these belts. Three 50 foot bundles, which fits nicely. We got a 24 foot extension and a 14 foot roof ladder, exterior mounted, easy access for the firefighter or uh, officer to get it off street or curbside. Got a small compartment here. We'll keep miscellaneous stuff in here, a roller to a hose, uh, maybe an oil dry bucket. And we'll roll into here and we got uh, three bottle air packs or three bottle storage for air bottles. The rear compartment will be used for saws, a uh, K-12 and a chainsaw. Another unique feature here is emergency lighting in the rub rail. At the rear of the truck, we went with a low hose bed option. Uh, underneath a 750 gallon tank. Low hose bed gives the option for different hose configurations, which crews like. Uh, we got a bomb line, two and a half inch, 200 foot bomb line, which is attached to a, a monitor here. Quick uh, little master stream device. 1,200 foot of five inch. Uh, this would be 200 foot inch and three quarter, pre-connected. 300 foot inch and three quarter. Uh, this will be a two and a half dead lay with an apartment lay on top. And another uh, pre-connect on this side, two and a half, 200 foot. We got a nice good tailboard here wide for the firefighters. If they need to get up, we went with a low hose bed, so hopefully they wouldn't have to, but if they need to get up on it. Uh, rear compartment, uh, miscellaneous hose, uh, hydrant bag. In this rear compartment, we'll keep, uh, we'll keep a fan, battery powered, battery powered LED lights, 
Uh, this truck, we opted, these trucks, we opted to go with no generator, battery powered options, cuts down on cost and space really. Uh, backlit LED, red compartments with night spot painting, which looks real good at night and also has good visibility for working at night. Driver's high side compartment, be a tool board, mount hand tools, different hand tools, same backlit, red LED option. Driver's air pack will be in here. Is the engineer's compartment, engineer's gear, appliances mounted, pretty convenient. We went with a 2,000 gallon minute waterist pump. Uh, pump boss, we have an air prime auto primer, and we also went with this Line X backing on the pump panel, easy to clean, keeps it nice clean look. All right, we got a unique painted bumper, Line X on top, notch for the Q, protects the Q a little bit. We got air horns, sirens both corners, and we'll keep 150 foot inch and three quarter in here for uh, quick car fires, trash fires. Uh, for visibility, we went with high vis LED light bars, two on the sides, one on the front. Also on the rear apparatus, push button. So as soon as you pull up, you can hit it. No generators. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being interested in our Concord's Pierce Enforcers.